Uh, today on the show, we're headed to a local spot here in Lakeview, Lincoln Park. Lincoln Park. Yeah, I think this is technically Lincoln Park. Lincoln Park. Uh, we're going to Sandwiched, which, as you can probably assume, sells sandwiches. That's, he's looking for it over there. Yeah, Sandwich Chicago. Yeah. So Sandwich Chicago, Chicago, Illinois, lunchtime. How about a patty melt? How about it? You guys in? You want one, sir? <laughs> Patty melts from Sandwiched, acquired here on the north side of Chicago, jump cut. Dude, just like old times, on the big camera. Ooh. Kind of not a second angle, just like the best angle. Ooh. All right, hit him with it. Uh, so loving this packaging so far. This is, I don't know what this nice little like handhold thing is, but this is kind of cool. Let's open it up and see what we got. Whoa, okay, okay. A lot of seeds on this rye bread, which I dig. Toasted to perfection on the top, it's looking like. If we open it up and see, there's our burger with all the caramelized onions on it. Um, possibly some sort of sauce on there, maybe? Uh, yeah. I'm not sure, it's like a red tinted sauce. And then you can kind of see, like over here you can see a little bit better, the, uh, the cheese all melted down there. Um, yeah, pretty standard patty melt, and then I guess it comes with a side pickle. Yeah, we wanted to do this place for a while. Yeah, this part on my running route. So I seen it, I said, I like sandwiches. I'd like to try that spot. All right, Sixers, local spot, sandwiched, patty melt. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. A lot of caramelized onions, which I love. Mm hmm. That was the first flavor I got. Instant sweetness. Mm hmm. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's a good patty melt. I like rye bread. I, I like patty melt. I sound like a kid. Yeah, you I sound like, like rye bread. You sound like George of the Jungle. I like patty, patty melt like me. Look at this Jeep. Oh, yeah. Also going way too fast. <laughs> yeah, he's cruising. Patty melts are a really slept on sandwich. Mm hmm. Like, everybody who's had a patty melt likes a patty melt, but people don't really talk about them. Mm -mm. That's not something that fast food restaurants really do. Nope. You got grilled cheese? Yeah. Yeah. You want to throw a hamburger in there? Sure. Corey and I off camera were talking about this. I used to get patty melts at Steak and Shake in high school all the time. Mm -hmm. That place was open 24 hours. Yeah, they were like Frisco, you said? Get the Frisco melt. Yeah, I remember hearing about that. Mm -hmm. Or seeing that or something. Yeah, this is pretty good. I mean, it's like, it's a standard patty melt. There's not much to it. You got good rye bread, right. check. Is it cheesy? Yep. Check. It's got good hamburger, check. And then caramelized onions, boom, boom, boom. I know, it's all there. Show you kind of the inside on the big camera as well. Kind of get that crispiness on the outside, that nice juicy, moist patty and cheese in there. I might even try this pickle. Sometimes I'm in a pickle mood. Today's one of those days. Oh my God, pigs are flying. Boink, boink. Hello, everybody. Whee! Hello, flying pig. This has got to make it better. Yeah, dude. Sixer sauce mixing with Russian dressing has got to be a good combo. What's Russian dressing? It's vodka? Yeah. Oh, that's really good. Mm -hmm. That's our hot sauce. This is just like a good spot to stop for lunch, like during the work day. Not too heavy, mm -hmm. good flavor, in and out of there in 10 minutes. It's cute. I like that side entrance, I think that's really cool. Me too. I bet they got good soups, places like that usually have good soups. Yeah, if you're into looking like a 10, good salads. Mm -hmm. If you're into looking like a four, patty melts. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Ginger. Yeah, that um, that was 10 bucks a sandwich, five bucks a half. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all, fun trying a new little uh, lunch spot in Chicago, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. Right on Clybourne, easy, boom, bam, boom, in and out. Mm-hmm. All right, before we go ahead and rate the patty melt sandwich from Sandwiched, Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out, Patreon shout out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, we got a Patreon. If you don't know what that is, it's kind of like a monthly Kickstarter. You decide, you know what, guys, I want to help donate to the show. That's what you can do. We have damn near 200 patrons that help the show. Um, people get free shirts for $25 a month. You get to pick where we go for $30 a month. You get early content. You get um, access to uh, webcam footage of Corey's bedroom. Wait, that's not one of the, we thought about that, we kicked that yeah, one Yeah, I offered, that's on you porn. <laughs> so today, we're gonna go ahead and name, Corey's gonna get out the notebook of 
Secrets? No, notebook of Organization. Prisoner of Secret Band, and uh, we're gonna name two people that donate to the show. Patreon shout out number one goes to Dimitri K. Uh, he just up to the $30 one. Oh, he gets to pick where we go. Super awesome, yeah. Um, I just sent him to, this is from forever ago. Okay. He won a gift card. Mm. And uh, then I messaged him, and then he didn't see the message. I mean, this is like nine months ago. <laughs> okay. And then uh, when we did all those thank you cards, I had re emailed him that. He's like, oh, bro, I just saw this message. But can I still get that gift card? I'm like, yeah. Yeah, bro. What do you <laughs> yeah. want? What do you want? Chipotle? Chipotle. Chipotle it up. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not sure. He he did give us a suggestion. Like we, Sean said, the $30 people get a suggestion. He was like, why don't you go try some weed stuff Edibles? at the dispensaries? And I was like, I don't, that we, how about, can we do food? And he goes, yeah, there's weed food. <laughs> Stupid, and I'm like, oh yeah, I'm an idiot. I forgot about weed food. So I don't know if we're gonna be able to do that or not. Um, definitely not in the car. Yeah, let's get some suckers. But uh, just sit there and suck on them. Yeah, maybe we're gonna. I'm gonna. I gotta look up and see if there's anything that's like worth eating. I don't want to just like have some lozenges, <laughs> you know, and be like, yeah, give it a two, you know, or whatever. So I appreciate Dimitri oh, that K's. Got smoked. Yeah, by that door almost killed him. Dimitri K. I like the creativity though. Love it. Patreon name number two, Mr. Dan Hunt. Woo! He up to the $30 a month as well. Uh, wanted us to go to Labriola to get toasted ravioli nachos. If you haven't seen that review, uh, check it. It's linked below. Those were delicious. Great yeah, suggestion. Ravioli nachos we did. Dan, one of the best suggestions of all time. No doubt, no doubt. Patreon.com forward slash number six with cheese. Donate as little as a dollar a month and we will shout you out. Thank you so much for supporting the show. More shout outs to come next week. All right, Corey Wagner, for damn near 900 videos, this is how it goes. You eat, then you rate it. Out of five, Patty Manning. I was gonna say that. Nice, 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 nice. One of the hottest cartoons. Bro, uh, other than she was Jasmine, a, she dude. Was Bro, don't come in with the Patty Ma Mayonnaise when Jasmine's out there now, in the world, one bro. Seed, one seed is Jasmine. Two seed, close second, Patty Mayonnaise. Two seed, bro. I don't know, bro. Snow White, something about us sleeping. You lady. are. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the Bill Cosby came out of me. <laughs> Haven't you ever noticed after people have some of my barbecue sauce, after a while when it kicks in, they get all huggy buggy? No, don't. There's no, he's not. It's not who he is as a person. <laughs> all right, out of five patty mayonnaise is from Doug Funny. How many patty mayonnaise do you give the patty melts? Ten dollars sandwiched, Corey. Uh, that was a good patty melt. The rye bread really did it for me. That was really, really good rye bread. Um, caramelized onions were good. The burger was good. The cheese was good. Um, it was kind of just a standard. There wasn't, it's not like it blew me away. I think I've had patty melts that were like a little more mind blowing. A little more flavor. A little more every flavor. Bite. You could do, uh, like I put bacon on my, like you could mm. spruce it up a little bit. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna give that a, a still super solid uh, three. I'm gonna give that a three. Yeah, I was a little higher. I think it should have something else. Maybe the Russian dressing mixed with like, put a little spice to it. Maybe like a little spicier Russian Ooh. dressing. Or maybe add like, it just needs like a little more flavor. Everything that's there, the base is great. Yep. That's where like hot sauces and certain condiments will kind of ramp up those tastes. Yep. The Russian dressing, maybe a little more of it might have done it. I was thinking the whole time 3.5. Yeah, that's great. 3.5 out of 5 for a sandwich that we didn't really even know existed until recently. I'm down with that, dude. You know? You know? And an average patty melt, a 2.5 patty melt, is still a hell of a patty melt. 100%. You know? I'm happy we went here. You this know? is a positive thing. This is a good thing. I might tell that guy cigarettes are bad once we're done with this video. <laughs> Guys, we'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video back in the fast food chain. As you know, Tuesdays and Thursdays are. We'll see you then. Thank you so much for supporting the show. Patreon rules the world.